MMC for Roads and Transport, Sheila Sengubuche, bowing out. She believes that the recent controversies surrounding her will affect her performance in the public service. Last weekend, she was implicated in a Sex in the City audio tape scandal with equally embattled mayor Stevens Mohalapa. They've denied allegations that they are involved in sexual relations. It's now also alleged that Sengu Buche was illegally elected to the Tswane Council as she did not have a South African citizenship in 2016. The DA in Tswane says her resignation is not an admission of guilt, but says it will investigate the issues of her citizenship. We would appreciate the fact that at the time I was not the original chairperson, but I'm not passing the bag. It is my responsibility to go back and look into what really transpired, and I would go back and look for the facts and then actually um, you know, separate fact from fiction. I mean, at this stage, obviously, you can see MMC Sinkubuche has been finding herself in all sorts of um, 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 Allegations. Um, um, allegations. And I don't, no one can put it past the fact that she's under attack. Meanwhile, Asengu Buche's alleged sex in the city scandal partner, Mayor Stevens Mohalapa, is still on special leave. At this stage, obviously, the mayor is still the executive mayor of the city who is on leave and nothing has changed in terms of his status. So he is not indicating that he's going to resign. The mayor of Tswane is not indicating that he's going to resign. Not at all. He's not indicated that he will resign. And I think um, it is a responsible thing to do as the leader. The DA says that despite the recent scandals in Tswane, it remains committed to service delivery. See Paul Sturman, SBC News, Pretoria.